Hi everyone and welcome to my Facebook live stream here on Monday. So my name is Joanna Bojarska and I'm a professional beauty therapist and also founder of Beauty by Joanna. And on these live streams here on Facebook every Monday I am showing you the endless possibilities of your home skincare. And we talk here about your face care, about your body care, but I'm also showing you and recommending you my most trusted products. So tonight we will talk about home hair removal and you would probably think about wait what hair removal i know how to do use razor it's not a rock and science is it you just take a blade and you start shaving and i would say yes sure this is quite a straightforward procedure but how many of you had after they shaved irritated uh, skin uh, inflammation on their skin, those strawberry, effect, strawberry legs effect, for example, and then ingrown hair. And then, for example, if you shave in the morning, then in the evening, you can already feel that coarse hair on your body. I guess quite a significant uh, part of you watching me right now could relate to at least one of those factors. If you're not, then congratulations, in, you are in that lucky group that don't have to worry about those things. Um, that's why I am not, the, I've never been the biggest fan of waxing either, um, before, because I think you I always recommend those regular uh, waxing treatments at professional beauty studio or laser um, hair removal if needed. But in ideal world, you would obviously come to my beauty studio. I will do your waxing and everything would be fine. But these days is a bit different. We have we all have to stay home and we have to do when we have to find a solution to what we have at the moment. And today I will show you the temporary solution, which you can easily do yourself at home until the time we can see each other again. And so obviously you don't have to do any of this. This is uh, I just do it because I got loads of messages and texts from my clients who are my regular client customers and they like to uh, they ask me basically Joanna what are we doing because obviously I can't do your normal waxing appointments and stuff so how do I cope with this so I thought I will gather all the information together and put it in your live stream so you can all watch it and maybe get uh, some helpful advice uh, from this live stream uh, so we have a few different uh, options of obviously home hair removal uh, so first one is that IPA laser device which you can get um, and use at home. The, the most important, the most popular ones are like Philips Lumea or Silkin or Brown ones. Yeah, and then I have a few clients who are actually using those devices, and they they see the difference. So it, you can't expect the same um, effects as you would get after the uh, professional laser hair removal at the clinic. But you will definitely see uh, that the regrowth is not as quick and the hair are not coming, uh, coming back as thick as they used to. But the thing with those home laser devices is that they don't work with blonde or red based hair. So if you are blonde like me and you have quite light, light hair on your body, unfortunately they won't, for you, they won't work for you. So that might not be the best investment. But if you have that more coarse, thicker, darker hair, that might work for you. And the prices for this kind of devices is between 250 and 500 pounds. Uh, I wouldn't go for those cheap IPL uh, devices because I've seen um, yesterday or the day before uh, an, um, an advert on Facebook that you can get yourself that IPL device for like uh, 50 pounds. I would be a bit more cautious about getting devices like this. I would go more for like trusted sources uh, and devices who have all this, uh, which have all the certificates and things like this. So this is the third op first option. Then you have a second option and is this cream, the most popular one, the Veet cream, yes? And this is like the chemical exfoli exfoliation of your hair. So basically it's gonna dissolve your hair. But because it has that thioglycolic acid and potassium hydroxide, so if not used accordingly to the extraction, it can go very wrong. So you can 
you can end up with rash, allergic reaction, you can end up with stinging. And yeah, so loads of things can go wrong here. So if you are the person who is using this kind of cream or if you are using this kind of uh, products for the first time, I always recommend to do a little patch test, especially if you have a sensitive skin, because don't, don't apply it on the whole leg because you might end up with loads of redness and loads of burning. So always do a patch test before using this. And then the next option which you can do at home is epilator. And probably all of us, we've used epilators at least once, uh, once in our lives. And please wave to me who is still using it because for me it's just it just hurts. Uh, I can't do it. It's I rather do waxing because you just strip this wax quickly and it's done. Then do those um, this uh, epilator. But if your uh, pain threshold is quite high, then great, you can do your epilators. But with epilators, the thing is that loads of my ladies are coming to me and saying that they're using epilator on their legs, for example, and they're getting loads of ingrown hair. And we have solutions for the ingrown hair as well, and I will be talking about it in a second. And that will be the third option. And then the fourth option, the uh, fourth option uh, and that will be the option which I am talking which I will be talking about now is the old classic old razor and uh, yes I don't I never thought I will be talking in on my lives about the razor uh, shaving at uh, at home but the times are like a day as they are so we have to find a solution so the razor which will, will be obviously the cheapest option and um, but with razor uh, you have to I would recommend to do a little bit before and after the shaving so obviously you get yourself the razor yes and the more blades it has the better because the shaving will be more precise you can get yourself men version this is my husband's one and then you can get yourself feminine version so uh, whichever you prefer but the more the more blades the better let's say and then what i would recommend before you even start shaving is to have a warm or hot bath or shower because what that it will do it will start making the skin more soft and getting the shaving more precise yeah precise okay so that will be definitely this warm hot uh, warm or hot bath or shower and then you need something um, a product which will give you the sleepiness um, while you are shaving i wouldn't recommend just to shave with water because that can give you lots of irritate loads of irritation so i would definitely uh, recommend some like this they say they sell them at booths or drugs a uh, um, super drug those like olay foams and things like this but if you have a partner a very easy option to do is to use his shaving cream so this is actually my husband's one and he's using the Aveda one this is a 99% naturally um, derived uh, product it has beautiful smell of vetiver lavender and lemon so very unisex although it was packaged in the men packaging because basically uh, we wanted some products for men there but very good product so you can use that but let's say you don't have a partner you live on your own and you have to use something and you don't want to buy this foamy thing from the drugstore you can use your old um well not old your usual conditioner yes you heard me right hair conditioner you might not want to go for the most expensive one which you have because that will be just the wastage of product but hair conditioning is the very old-fashioned way to remove your hair probably most of you heard about it because it gives you that beautiful sleepiness and makes the, uh, the shaving very smooth so definitely hair conditioner so you apply a little bit of hair conditioner and then you start shaving and then what you would like to do as well before the shaving uh, it's a scrub and I definitely recommend you do a body scrub um, I would either choose the dry brush uh, or a coffee scrub I wouldn't go for a salt crystal based scrub because obviously when you shave you can create the little micro wounds on your body and then you might be like ah it hurts so we want me we want it to be a pleasant experience rather than painful one so I would definitely recommend uh, like dry brushing, coffee scrub 
or maybe something with more spherical beads inside like jojoba bead scrap um, and if you would like to hear more about the scraps i was talking about those things in my last video when i was talking about body care and i also uploaded a youtube video about my sunday self-care so i'm showing you loads of different options of different homemade body scraps you can do so definitely body scrap and then uh, because a good body scrap body will do it will smooth the skin it will open the pores plus it will soften the skin and then it will reduce the risk of getting ingrowns or inflammation while you're shaving okay so we had a shower we had a body scrub we got um, we got our conditioner or the shaving cream or whatever you prefer and then we are starting to shave so when you are shaving you don't want to go against the hair grow so what you want to do definitely first of all start shaving with the way the same way as your hair grows so definitely for my ladies who are my usual clients when it comes to waxing or whenever wherever you go to for you to your waxing definitely start with with the growth of your hair not against it because that might be enough you might be surprised that might that might be not enough and you don't have to irritate those follicles of yours of your hair so basically go uh, with the with the length of your hair how they grow and then only if needed you go against it yes so with the hair growth first the same side and then against it and then we are done we have our shaving done so uh, after the shaving obviously aftercare is very important and i would always recommend to use freshly washed towel Mm, just in, just to reduce that uh, inflammation or irritation uh, uh, or like a kind of infection let's say a uh, process to minimize that risk even more so always freshly washed towel you dry it out yourself and then it will be good if you would be using aftercare and when it comes to aftercare i would definitely uh, go with things which will slow down the growing process of your hair so for example you so i have i'm working on a depilev run in my beauty studio and i don't have this product tonight because i've sold out everything and i am waiting for the delivery but obviously now the post is rather slow so i have to wait a bit longer than usual but it will be available to purchase on my online uh, facebook shop if you would like to, if you would be interested so this will be this brand and it's like a little serum which you are applying in the places when you get like the most ingredients grown hair or the most inflammation or the most irritation and that will definitely calm down those um, those concerns plus it will slow down the regrowth uh, of your hair okay and then another thing uh, because even if you would follow all those uh, steps let's say every time when you shave uh, you still can get some ingrown hair yeah and in this case i have very good products which actually haven't been created for ingrown hair so pads so those are those uh, antibacterial pads which my clients are usually buying for um, when they have like acne or breakout prone skin because those products they are usually sold with salicylic acid so this is a typical salicylic acid the Aveda one has salicylic acid from natural source and this is from winter green glass uh, winter green grass and um, so basically what they do the clients they can what i always recommend to do for my clients if you have acne prone breakout skin let's do two two scenarios so you have acne prone uh, skin uh, you buying those pads you take the pad you wipe your face but after wiping your face you can also wipe the areas when you get you tend to get your ingrown hair or even just to disinfect those areas so i usually go like i will do my face first of all obviously and then if i have some problem in my like underarms or so you can also run it there or in your more private areas um, if i say so so um so yeah you can definitely use them this way so then you don't waste any product but i have loads loads of customers who are buying this product purely for their ingrown hair 
beautiful product. It really get that inflammation down. If you feel like it's growing already and you have that bum on your skin, this, if you put this, it will disinfect it, get the inflammation down. So great product if you suffer with ingrown hair. Definitely would recommend those uh, if you if you get this ingrown hair. But in order, if you don't tend to get as much ingrown hair, but you are a little bit afraid because obviously you use shaving now and you don't know how your skin will behave, then I would definitely recommend to do another body scrub um, two week, two days after you shaved, just to make the skin even smooth, um, moisturized, replenished plus replenish with moisture plus it will definitely slow down this um, regrowth process and you will you will be you know enjoying your smooth skin for longer so that's definitely this then i would also definitely recommend to use body lotions body butters body oils so we were talking about those in my last live stream so um, all my live streams as well are, are uploaded on my youtube channel it's like two, three days after, but they are all there. So you can go and check them out there as well if you want to. Definitely some kind of body lotion just to keep your hair, just to keep your skin soft, moisturized. And it's definitely gonna make that skin look, uh, make make softer for longer. Uh, okay, so I think that will be everything when it comes to shaving. Very quick, very easy because I wanted to make it quick because it's supposed to be a quick process. It shouldn't be taking too long. So definitely bath or shower, then scrub, then shaving on hair conditioner if you like and then uh, aftercare so those pads or the for example body lotion so whatever you prefer or the folisan uh, which will be available at my beauty studio soon okay let me know if you have any questions in the comment section below so i uh, if regarding shaving and also let me know what other topics you would like me to talk about but stay tuned stay tuned because i have more things to tell you tonight uh, uh, and let me see if I have any comments. Hello, everyone. Oh, Kasia is asking, can you get those online? Yes, you can get those uh, pads, I mean, yeah. Yes, those pads are available on my uh, online Facebook shop. But if you can't see them, because for now, Facebook, for some weird reason, sometimes is blocking some items. Uh, they're getting new algorithms and it doesn't work as well as it used to. So if you can't find them there, then text me because I have them in stock. So you can get them. Okay, guys, and now uh, I've told you yesterday on my Instagram stories that I will have a surprise for you. And uh, before I will talk about this surprise, I just wanted to tell you how thankful and grateful I am for your support. I mean, I am overwhelmed with your messages, with your texts or with your photos which you're sending me and nothing makes me more happy than seeing your photos um, uh, when you put my advice into action, ac into actual action. So I love seeing those and thank you very much for sharing them with me. Uh, I mean, I am happy that I can help you. I can keep you entertained here and a little bit distracted in this in this. Uh, extraordinary times so uh, so yeah and I because I am so thankful and grateful I was thinking what I could do to you to show you my appreciation so I am organizing a giveaway so this if in this giveaway I'm gonna ask you for only two little things so if you could please um, put uh, write down the opinion about me, my beauty services in um, here on Facebook in the recommendation and reviews section. So that's the first thing. So opinion about my beauty services or my lives, for example, whatever you like in the recommendation and reviews section here on Facebook. And then if you can invite two of your friends to like my fan page, Beauty by Joanna. Uh, and if you can do that, then you will take the part in the prize draw in my giveaway. And now basically, ah, and I will be uh, drawing uh, the person who won, um, who will be the lucky winner next week on my live stream. So we will find out who is the lucky winner together here next week. And now the best part, I'm gonna show you what's in that giveaway. So basically in that giveaway, I wanted to, in um, incorporate the things which I'm actually talking uh, 
uh, about here on Facebook on my lives. So first thing will be a trio of Aveda products, Aveda beauty products. Uh, so here you will have, this is their uh, standard scent, Champure, um, and here you will have the body wash, body lotion, and that uh, little um, a hand cream which I'm always raving about this hand relief so you will have a chance to try this everything obviously packaged in a beautiful box and then I have more as well and then I also wanted to include one of the essential oils Aveda one and I've chosen lavender because I think we all need some uh, stress relieving sense around us these days, def definitely these days. And this is, uh, th those oils are my favorite one because you are, you can use them in many different ways. You can use them straight on your body. Uh, you can put them into your bath. You can add them to the diffuser and make therapy sort of session for yourself at home. And then you can put them on your hair as well. So you can use them in so many different ways. So the lavender oil will be in my giveaway as well but this is not the end I have more and then you know which one is my favorite cleanser the uh, purifying gel cleanser from Aveda so I'm gonna give you a travel size of this gel cleanser but this is a travel size which we which will last you for at least two weeks morning and evening so this is a genuine um, travel size so this one the my favorite gel cleanser will be there as well and then I wanted to because I'm always saying how important the moisturizing is so I wanted to include as well the moisturizing hydrating lotion from Aveda to, uh, to try as well so that will be my giveaway for for the next week so yes and then I hope some one of you can enjoy this little set uh, here uh, I hope you found I hope you are okay with this and that's something which would interest you and we can all have fun with it okay guys so um I hope this little life uh, was helpful today and please tell me later if you actually used already any of those uh, tips which I was uh, which I was showing you today and let me know how was your shaving uh, obviously you don't have to do any of this because if you are uh, the person who doesn't mind a little bit more hair here and there that's absolutely fine just leave it or maybe you don't shave at all you do you whatever you feel comfortable with I'm, I was just showing it today because I got loads of requests from my clients but I hope you found it helpful and the next week topic is because my clients are always telling me that they don't have time for certain things in their lives to learn new things in their lives but now there is no excuse we have loads of time to learn new things and we should be learning new things so next uh, next week I want to show you um, everything about everyday very quick and easy makeup makeup which will be, be which will be great for any kind of work you may you, you having uh, and you do it in five seven ten minutes so I will show you a very quick quick and easy tips and tricks on how to make yourself look put together and ready to go and be confident and feeling good with uh, um, yourself and this makeup is not gonna be about making mask on your face or creating a different person from you it will be to show you how you can embrace and enhance your natural features so I will be showing you my favorite products the products which I trust which I'm always using when I'm in rush uh, in the morning and I have to get ready in five or six minutes so I will be showing you everything uh, next week in regards to how I do my everyday makeup and how you can do your everyday makeup in a very quick way five minutes and you can be done and I hope you will find this uh, interesting please let me know if you would like to hear about uh, anything else any ideas you have anything uh, any questions in regards to the beauty world please ask me you can even either leave it um, leave the comment in the section here or you can message me directly so please if if there is anything what you would like me to talk about on this channel on my life I, I am here for you and I can always talk about this okay guys I hope you found this 
helpful and interesting. Have a lovely evening and I will see you next week, Monday 7 p.m. or tomorrow, Instagram 7 p.m. when I will be talking about more uh, technical things about my beauty uh, professional face treatments. Okay, thank you very much, guys. Thanks. Bye.